Hey YouTube family, welcome back or welcome to Lin Lin. Today I got my son Asar with me. Hi. <laughs> We're about to head into Walmart and I have a few things that I want to pick up. I have a list actually of things that I want to pick up in here today. I have a $60 budget. I don't think what I'm going in here to get will go over $60. So let's go in here and let's see what kind of deals they have going on in neighborhood Walmart, guys. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we are headed into neighborhood Walmart. I got my little helper. We're about to go in here on a $60 budget. I always come straight to the produce anytime I come to the store in general. I don't know why, but I always come to the produce first. I'm gonna start over here because there's a lot of people over there in the front. So their strawberries in here are $1.98. They're only $1.25 at Winco, but I'm not going to Winco today. So, and these ones don't look bad. These are the Central West ones. These are the ones that I have been buying for a while, but they stopped um, selling them at Winco. Get two of these Central West strawberries. These ones always look good. I like these new things that they have at Walmart now. I haven't seen these. These are little temperature things and they show the prices on them. This is their new signage, I guess, in here. He wants to get some grapes. Which grapes do you want? You want the green ones or which ones? The purple ones? Yes. The grapes are $2.68 for the green ones. Oh, this is the price that it was. So $2.68 is the sale price and they were $3.12. But he's saying he wants the purple ones. These ones right here. So those grapes are $2.88 a pound. We're gonna get a small bag of them. Okay, so we got us a bag of grapes right here and some strawberries. They still do not have seeded watermelons. Everywhere I've gone, they have not put out the seeded watermelons yet. The blueberries are $2.97 for the big pack. Okay, this size isn't bad. What is this? This is uh, 11 ounce. So the 11 ounce is $2.97. I thought I had seen some other blueberries. These ones are $4.36. So the 2.97s are a better deal. I'm gonna get these blueberries right here. These are $2.97. What you got, tahine? Yeah, you're not getting that. What are you doing with that? I'm gonna find some ambrosia apples. I got them out of here one time, but have not been able to find them since. These ones are honey crisps. Oh, their apples are kind of expensive. These ones are on rollback for $3.58. And I wanna say they're only $1.99 at um, Winco. Yeah, their apples are a little higher in here. $3.96 for the Granny Smith, $4.98 for the honey crisp. The Cosmic Crisp for $5.24. Pink Ladies are $3.98. And then the Red Delicious are $4.78. Yeah, sorry, you're not getting that. Put that down. The Red Delicious is a five pound bag. And you get what? Two, four, six, eight. I think you get about 12, 12 apples in here, is what it feels like. So I think that's not a bad deal, $4.78 for 12 apples. So I'm gonna go ahead and get one of the bags of the Red Delicious five pound bag for $4.78. So they have the cherries in here for $2.98. These ones look a little good. They are not as dark as the other ones that I've seen in Winko that one time. But this is what they look like. Can you see it? Can you see it? So I think I'm gonna get some of these. The lemons are 58 cents a piece in here. I'll wait till I go to Winko to get lemons because it's a better deal. I think I can get a bag of oranges for a better deal than that. Cause these ones are 98 cents a piece. I think we can get a bag of oranges for a better deal. 
I am out of broccoli, so I'm gonna get a couple of heads of broccoli. The broccoli in here is a dollar and seventy-four cents. I think at Winco it's like a dollar twenty-eight. But I'm just gonna get a couple of them today, so it shouldn't be um, more than a pound, actually. They had corn on the cob in here. Oh, here it is. This corn right here, we came and got some a couple days ago and I just cooked them last night. This corn is so good, y'all. 33 cents a piece for this corn in here. The kids helped me peel them last night. I'm not gonna get none today because I'm gonna get more green vegetables um, for the next couple days. Yeah. See, these salads in here are $2.97. I'm gonna go back to Winco probably um, in the next couple days, probably not tomorrow, but the day after to get some more of those salads and see if there's still 98 cents in there um, because that was a really good deal that I found on those salads in Winco that day. Look at all this sweet stuff. Oh, these look good right here. Chocolate chip sandwich cookies. You know, those are so sweet. Those are six dollars and ninety-eight cents. These cream cheese raspberry, cream cheese and raspberry. Uh, those look kind of dry. Six dollars and forty-seven cents for those. He's pointing to these little black and white cookies. Those are three dollars and forty-eight cents. Those things are probably really, really sweet. They got these decadent bars, platters brownie and lemon and seven layer. I just had something like this a couple days ago at work. It was really good. It's actually very similar. It just didn't have the white chocolate type stuff or is that coconut? I think that's coconut. It didn't have the coconut and the peanut butter cups, but it did have the chocolate chips. It was really good too. So they have some chickens in here. These were just baked. These were just cooked about an hour ago, 9.40. These ones are $5.97 in here. I wanted to get a chicken last night because I didn't feel like cooking and I got to the store too late to get one. I'm gonna grab one today because I will probably eat that tonight. I got the chicken because I'm probably gonna just throw that in the oven tonight. Every time I get these little chickens right here, I always put them in the oven and cook them for a little while longer because I think, I don't know, I feel like they undercook them. They don't cook them as well. That was one of the things that I wanted to come in here and get. It was on my list. Another thing on my list is some shredded cheese. I want to get this medium cheddar one. This is $2.22. I think I may have passed the Parmesan cheese. I like to use the Parmesan cheese like this. Here we go. So this is a little bit cheaper at um, Winco. It actually is probably like a dollar and some change cheaper at Winco. But because I'm not going over there today and I need this cheese, I'm just going to go ahead and grab it from in here today. It is $3.94. So the last time I came into Walmart, they had um, two different cheeses that I had never seen before. It was like Carolina Reaper blend and the other one was like mac and cheese blend or something. Today they have these two. This is limited edition. This is Hickory Smokehouse Blend. It says Hickory Smoked Gouda Cheese and Provolone Cheese with Natural Smoke Flavor. This is great for melting is what it says. And then they also have this Casserole Blend. I've never seen this before. It may not be new, but it's new to me. This one says great for bacon and it's cheddar and pasteurized processed American cheese. Never seen American cheese in a blend. So this might be new and it says limited edition. And this is at Walmart right now for $2.22. Another thing on my list is the uncured turkey bacon. This is $3.72. I can actually only find this in here. I remember I used to always buy these caramel flavored rice cakes. These have gone up a lot. These are $3.48 in here right now. I like how they have these though, was and then the rollback price. Kettle chips are two dollars and sixty-eight cents. I like these jalapeno flavored ones. The barbecue ones right there are two dollars and sixty-eight cents as well. Oh, and they also have the sea salt and vinegar ones. So all of those are on rollback. Yeah, the crack black, the crack black pepper ones too. Walmart brand chips are on rollback, or the Great Value brand chips are on rollback. Those are on rollback for two eighty-six. They were three dollars and eighteen cents. 
and grab a cup of waters. I really don't like these gallon types. I like the round ones, but they don't have the round ones, or they don't sell those ones in here anymore. They're just this, this gallon. So this slow cooker is in here for $19.87. It doesn't say the original price, but I need to invest in a new one of these. Somehow my daughter broke the glass part like knocked it over and the whole thing shattered so obviously i'm not able to use it anymore because the main part of it is broken i think i might actually come back and get this i didn't intend on coming to get this today i'm only here to buy groceries and actually some lysol but that is a good deal for that this is a 20 inch griddle at walmart right now this is $19.87 was $24.98, so that's a good deal for that. They have these down here. I can't remember if the last time I came, if they were the $7.24 or if they were cheaper, but $5.97 for that, you can't beat that price. I'm gonna get the mandarin oranges. They love the oranges. They didn't really like the cherry and mixed fruit one, which is the one that I got last time. We're in the cookie aisle. He said he wants a snack. You gotta get something for everybody though. Oh no, we're not getting those ones. You gotta find something else. Ranch is one of my things on my list that I need to get. I like to get the Hidden Valley. This is $3.98. Another thing on my list is some Jasmine rice. This rice is $6.84 for the, what is this? This is a five pound bag of jasmine rice for $6.84. I'm gonna get some great value tortillas. These ones right here are $2.12 and this is the fajita pack and it comes with, oh, uh, this is 20 of them. This comes with a pack of 20 of them. Which ones you want? He wants to get some donuts. I let them eat sweets every once in a while. You guys probably don't see me buy sweets too often. I try to limit the amount of sweets that they get, but today I'm gonna be nice and let them get some donuts. You sure you want the powdered donuts? I also wanted to grab some drumsticks. These drumsticks all seem to be within $7. These ones right here are $6.65. These ones are $6.16. I think I'm gonna get these ones right here, 616 for these drumsticks. I'm looking at their shrimp and they don't have a big variety in here today. They're looking kind of bare today, so I think I'll hold out on the shrimp and get it from Winco instead. So I came down this aisle because I need to get some disinfectant spray. Um, my oldest kids have come home and they have been sick for a couple days now with sneezing and coughing and all that. So disinfectant is needed and I will be getting the Great Value brand. It is $4.48. The regular brand, the Lysol is $7.97. So let me see. They have the lemon one. This one is the Morning Meadow Scent and the Fresh Linen. Um, I think I'm gonna go with the morning metal scent. So somehow I ended up over here by the toothbrushes and I see these, you get five of them for a dollar. You can't beat that. He wants these new toothbrushes, even though I'm pretty sure they're, what, these are for ages three plus. I mean, I guess they're fine, but he's excited for those toothbrushes. Let me see. You like those toothbrushes? Yes. One dollar in Walmart for those toothbrushes. They have these cute little tumblers in here, 50 cents. These are cute, I like these colors. Yes, they have this color right here. Then they have the blue one. Then they got the blue one right here. They also have the bowls. The bowls are 50 cents as well. These are cute, I might have to come back up here and get some more of these. They got the pink one and the orange one. They got a couple plates down there as well. Just those color plates. So those are the only plates they have down there. 
They also have these little tumblers right here. $5 for these. It's the pink one up there. That one's cute. They have this little one right here. This is a little squishy thing. That's $3.98. Not leave that alone. Okay guys, so this is everything that I have today that I'm going to be getting out of Walmart. I got some strawberries, blueberries, some grapes, some cheese, and some rice. I got some apples down there and cherries. I got chicken on the bottom. I got a whole chicken. I got some disinfectant spray. So I am about to head to the register guys. My um, limit that I wanted to spend was $60 or my budget that I wanted to spend and not go over $60. So let me know if you guys think this is going to be over or if you guys think it's going to be under. Let's go to the register and find out, guys. Okay, family, that is the end of the video. You guys seen the total, right? I spent $62.10. So I went over my budget by $2.10, but that's okay. I did not go completely over. Got a lot of great value items, and I got everything that was on my list, besides the donuts. But we got the donuts for him back there. That is the end of the video. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I will see you guys all in the next video, all right? Bye.